Hello viewers, this is Kontiki Cultural Women Empowerment bringing you a special presentation on Kontiki Multicultural Fashion Runway. We welcome you to the fifth annual Kentucky Multicultural Fashion Runway.
Introduce the major designers behind this segment, Ramiran and Jonathan Nusip. Something about Africa is patterns and design. And uh, the work that Charles Sisai and uh, the wife and others within this industry have been doing to showcase the talent within our community is something that I think we have to acknowledge and admire. Years ago, I met um, Frances. I cannot really say where I met her, but we connected through clothes and everything, and she became one of my designers as well. And what I've admired between Frances and Charles is the commitment that they both have for each other when it comes to the work that they do together. It is something that we want to encourage, but we would love to bring other people to share the cultures of other groups. This is something that we do to promote cultural diversity. We have to look beyond where we are from and who we are. So, and also mainly empowering women. So, you know, this women issue going around in the world um, to surface what they're capable of. A community group in Sunshine has hosted a multicultural fashion show that brings more than just glamour to the runway. Melissa Liberatore reports. It wasn't just the collection of clothes that made a statement, but it was the diversity of people in the room that made this runway unique. The annual Kentucky Artistic Fashion Runway is organised by a not-for-profit organisation that empowers refugee and migrant women through fashion design. Collectively, the models and fashion designers represent over 10 different cultural backgrounds. Co-founder of Kentucky and runway coordinator Prince Va said he is excited to organise an event that brings the community together. So this year we have uh, uh, models from different backgrounds, designers from different backgrounds, and uh, our main goal is to promote uh, multiculturalism. For fashion designers like Mary Corrima, this event is an opportunity to get her name known in the industry while using fashion to transform people in positive ways. Yeah, if they feel great, then they'll be able to pretty much conquer anything. This is the fifth year Kentucky has held its multicultural fashion show, being held in the Bowery Theatre, named after renowned international designer Lee Bowery, who was raised in Sunshine. Victorian Multicultural Commissioner Dr Mimi Chi Watts said it is important to acknowledge the contribution that people from different groups make to our society. And when you look at events like today, 
fashion shows where they're not only showing cultural dresses, but they're also showing the talent that exists within our diverse communities here in Victoria. Melissa Liberatore, Mojo News.